Hi, I'm Georgette. Presently, we're operating out of Mel's Fish Shack um, right here on Farmdale and Jefferson, which is five blocks from our original location that we started in 1982. And right now, we're in the process of remodeling and reopening our original location. We need to raise the last phase of funding to get us open. So we had a structural problem and we needed to deal with that, so Mel's Fish Shack was born out of the need to transition over to a new location while we worked on the restaurant. This business, this business thing, this entrepreneurial thing, it's the spirit, it's in my DNA. I got all of it from my dad. All he told me to do was don't worry about it, just work. <laughs> You'll figure it out later. <laughs> I have a sister and brother, and we've all kind of grew up working with our dad, who was a serial entrepreneur, I would call him. I've been a part working with my dad since I was very young, probably nine years old. And when I graduated from college, I decided that I needed to come home and help my dad instead of pursuing a graduate degree. You know, we've been in this neighborhood all the time. I didn't want to see my dad struggle, and I wanted to see the business grow and flourish. I live here, I've grown up here, and this is who I am. You know, what I love about this neighborhood is it, it's a true neighborhood because there are few of us that have been around for, here for a long time. And it feels good. I mean, I drive around the city, but no place really feels like this because it's, it, it feels like home. A lot, of, a lot of people have aged and have moved away, but there are a lot of people that have just stayed here because it's a good place to be and it's definitely on the upswing. The reason I think you should give is because Mills Fish is a part of this community. We are the community. We do a ton of community events. We support Dorsey High School. We support their culinary arts program. We feed the homeless. We do pop-up kitchens on Skid Row. There are a lot of things. We feed the seniors. And it's important. It's important that we maintain our economic stability here in this neighborhood. And when my father first started, that was his main objective, was to create jobs and create economic stability. It's critical as a small business that we continue to support the work that we're doing collectively so that we have a safe community, a thriving community for, for everyone, for families. And that's important to me. Every day that I get up and someone thanks me for, you know, carrying on my dad's legacy, I mean, that's why I get up. So you, our customers, keep me getting up every day, and that's what I need. I need to get up every day. We've, we've been in business for 33 years. I'd like for this business to outlive me. We just want to get into our original location. That's all we want to do. So we continue doing the work that we do, spreading the love of good fish. <laughs>